Hey everyone, this is Mark, and I just wanted to uh, welcome you. <laughs> uh, so this is my practice. This is the very first practice for digital drawing or painting. And uh, right now what I'm doing, I'm just doing some like uh, value studies and just trying, trying out different brushes and seeing exactly what effect they have. I'm really super new at this, day one, right from scratch, and just sort of seeing what the brushes do and, and how the pen works. and and getting a feel for things. Um, this is sped up at about 10x, so it's 10 times the, the speed. Uh, so this is uh, kind of doing a practice of trying to create a circle using just the brush tool, the eraser, and the transform tool in Photoshop, and only being able to use those to try and make as close to a good circle as I can. So just sort of uh, trying it out, seeing how I could do, that's all right. And then from there I went on to do a, a tentacle, uh, just sort of a, a, a practice of uh, sketching and then inking in the sketch. So a lot of the, um, I think the fundamental skill of digital painting is, or drawing in general, is just being able to sketch well and being able to ink well. So uh, a lot of what I'm going to be doing in the initial phases of all of this is, is practicing that sketching to inking phase. I'm going to be doing a lot of that. So this is me just you know, trying it out and I didn't really like that first ink so then I going back through again and you'll see I go back and forth a lot. I'll, I'll try something out and I don't like it and I'll erase and I'll go back and do it again and I'll erase and I'll go back. So I do that a lot. Um, just because I'm still getting used to the pen and, and the Wacom bamboo tablet I'm using, I got it for free, but it's not really um, the best. It's, it doesn't track very smoothly. So there's a lot of things I'm trying to do like hash marks or something and it won't um, track those well at all. Uh, so here I, I'm going through with a thinner brush to do some detail work and, and this brush is too thin compared to the other line so it doesn't show up very well but you know you live and learn. So here I'm trying to do these uh, lines and I'm realizing that the stutter, stuttering of the pen um, is, is not making it very easy to do the drawing. I use the lasso tool and I copy and transform and I copy paste and transform and I'm just doing that. And this is all part of the, the sort of this online course study that I did. So this is one of the exercises that they have in this kind of fundamentals practice. Um, but probably what I'll do is I'll continue just finding shapes and objects that I want to try and do. Maybe find some reference objects to do it as well. The next thing I did was I, I just sort of started sketching and it turned into like this uh, little face. Um, uh, did I, I don't know facial proportions at all. I've never studied them. I don't really know how a face is supposed to be drawn. So um, as you can see, this is, I mean, it's all kind of like very, you know, elementary school kind of style of drawing. So it needs a lot of work. Um, but eventually I'm going to be doing some study of proportions of the human body and the face and all that stuff. Um, but again, this is just a practice of sketching and inking, sketching and inking. So I'm not worried as much about what it is I'm drawing as I am about the process of sketching something and then trying to ink it. So that's all this is about. Uh, turning down the opacity on the sketch and then just trying to go in and create some more definitive lines with a darker brush. And that's all it is. And you can see it's it's a struggle. <laughs> it's not easy. But I'm uh, just trying to work through it and get really get used to just going back and forth and painting and erasing and brush tool and erase tool and going back and forth and doing that. Um, I think the more I practice the skill, the better it'll get in the long run. The more I'll be able to really develop that skill. So that's a lot of what I'm doing here. Um, you'll uh, see that, okay, so I didn't like that, so I made it small on the side. And then I've drawn some trees before, so I thought I'd draw a tree, because I'm familiar with that shape and how that looks. And so I went through and um, sketched out a basic tree, and then um, decided to go in and then I started inking in. You'll see this process. So I think I did better with the tree than I did with the previous two. So it's improving slowly. I tried out some different brush styles there. Um, and I, I think uh, I'm just going to keep doing this. I'm going to find like objects in nature maybe and I start with nature or you know natural objects and sort of work from there. And then I'll, I'll, I'll try to go from there into maybe some machine type things or other things. Just I'll just kind of play it by ear and see how I feel. You know, all I have really have is a plan to practice a lot. So this is sort of my practice. And this, all of this together, these three objects took me about 55 minutes an hour or so. So sped up, it's about five and a half minutes. So 
I'm guessing I'll probably spend, try to spend like an hour each time I do this just to practice the sketching, practice the inking, practice the sketching, practice the inking, going back and forth over and over and over again. So um, I hope it's not too boring, but it, I think it'll be interesting to see sort of how this develops over time and how it grows and, and gets better. Um, so that's basically it. Three objects, first time trying to do some digital painting. Hope that was uh, interesting for you. <laughs> uh, feel free to subscribe if you want to keep seeing me do this uh, over time. And uh, thanks a lot. Have a great day.